What advice would you give to your 21-year-old self? Why is pussy a gift to a good man? Are boyfriends the new girlfriends? Uh, this is the game mo track. What up, yo, 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 uh, <laughs> yeah. I go by, uh, the undeniable <laughs> name of Damo, <laughs> never been a lame-o, yeah, It's that your round. boy, that boy, Bari. And this is Jay Willard, the podcast killer, yeah. a.k.a. the podcast poppy, a.k.a. the podfather, man, guess what, this is Willa Wednesdays. Yeah. It Y'all is. about to get some better news from, from your relationship guru. Hey, now. Bow. Gang. Back, 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 back. <laughs> Gang. Bow. Squat. Uh. Mm-hmm. Word. Uh. What's the word? What's happening, fellas? How we doing? Ain't shit. Talk to me. I'm alive. Can't complain, man. Okay. He's always down and shit. As soon as you get excited. Is that a bad thing? I said I'm alive, so I can't complain. but you say you alive. You always say it in such a non-alive way. You say it like you just made it from a suicide attempt. It's like, I'm alive. I say it. (laughs) I'm alive. Guns are blazing. We made it. You want to know why I say that all the time? Yeah. Because. Please tell me. I do want to know. In life, I feel like we as people, I was one of them. I'm including myself in that. A lot of times we felt like we had to complain or we needed to complain for even the smallest of things. So when I say, you know what, I'm alive, so I cannot complain. Because I'm alive, I have the ability to fix whatever situation or issue that's going on with me. I feel like I should have been playing a violin as you said that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like, Listen, don't make fun of my truth, player. That's my truth. Don't make fun of my truth. You know what? You're, you're messing horrible. with my mental health. I'm just, I'm just saying, like, <laughs> uh, yeah, that, that made me sad. No, it's not. It's a good thing. I'm saying, I'm, yo, you I'm, know what? Sir. I'm alive. Sir. I could fix whatever sir, bullshit I got going on. Sir, my reaction to that statement made well, me maybe sad. You need to, maybe saying. you need to look within yourself. I, I hear you. And hear <laughs> what I'm saying. It wasn't uplifting. Brother. How are you feeling, sir? Shit. Uh, now, I'm, now I'm pressured. I feel great. Uh, everything hey, is amazing. There uh, we go. Uh, it's been you a wonderful day, a wonderful life. Yes. Uh, all I want to do is spread positivity. <laughs> now, I feel great about that. No, that's your fault. That, damn. <laughs> I, I projected onto you. Yes, you, you did. Got you. So okay. that one's going to be my answer. My bad. My answer going was, I'm alive. Wow. I'm here. That's it, you man. See, I, you alive, man. <sighs> no, nigga, I don't talk like that. Ew. Hey, hallelujah. <laughs> Thank you. Like, that was what about you? Mm, bro. I don't, so, Bart, <laughs> all of you, listen. We need to speak more about what's going on with you because why? <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you! Sheesh! I, can't I think tell I got you, you for I real feel. though. I think I got you for real. You did. I, 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 was, I, I was ready to answer. Like mm-hmm. I've had a great week. It I mean, was, your I day was, ain't that damn special. I was Shit. ready to answer. Now what's going on though, bro? A lot. A Come lot. on, talk to me. Talk a to lot. me. A lot. A um, lot. I'm not gonna get into much, but okay. I say I'm blessed. Okay. And and I. I want. I'm, I'm thankful. Yes, yes. I'm, I'm mm. thankful for the group that I have around me. I'm Damn thankful right. For my friends, I'm thankful for my brothers. Things happening, y'all. Yes. Um, changes on the way. Yes. I, I, I'm thankful. Don't come. I'm thankful for y'all. Oh, yes, it will. And I, uh, okay, Sam Cook. Is it too I was born hard of living. Okay, it was my but seven I'm verse. afraid to die. Afraid to die. Okay. Cause I don't know what's up there. Yes. Beyond, beyond the sky. Beyond the sky. Got it's you. Beyond the clouds. It's been a long, a long time coming, coming, but I know a change gonna come. No, that note right there. Oh yes, it is. That note right there is lit. Oh, I love Sam Cook. Love Sam Cook. Y'all got me singing some old soulful shit. Love Sam Cook. But nah. It's, Every it's, time I hear that song, dope. I think about that Malcolm X movie. She's like, "Baby, don't pay them." Yeah, no, no that was beautiful. Yeah, don't that's like pay twenty them years no removed from the song. Like it was, yeah. It was. It was just a beautiful yeah. moment. Yeah. yeah. She said, anyway. "Baby, don't pay them no money." But no, I'm glad things is happening, man. Nah, yeah. It's a fact. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's 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 all beautiful. I'm glad for it. Yeah. I, I will tell y'all later. Okay. But I'm 
glad my brothers could share in this. I mean, with 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 what you're feeling and how excited you are for whatever it is, it, I'm assuming that it makes you reflect on the things that you have done. Yes. To get to the point, Absolutely. and I'm not talking about the mo- within the last three to four years. I'm talking about maybe even. 10, 15 years. Absolutely. Yeah. All the shit that you've had to do okay. or you've done to get to the point where you say, okay, you know what? Maybe I should start thinking like this now. Yeah. So I'm, I'm assuming I've done that with shit that I've done now in my life that I, I'm I think happy we about. I should. I've, I've, no, I know a lot of people, I'm not saying that it's, they do it purposely, but sometimes because they're just in the moment and the emotion of things, you just move so fast. You're like, okay, I got to do this. Cool. I got to right. do that. I got to do this. I got to you know do that. You know funny? I'll, I'll, I'll attribute it to this podcast, right? Hmm. We've done so many different things and moved so many different mountains and hit different yeah, plateaus. Right. We don't ever take the time to be like, oh, shit. Just reflect on what we've achieved. We just did that. And some of the shit we've it's done. always like, yo, we're not good enough. What's we need next? to work harder. What's next? Right, what, right, how right, how right, do we right. get to the next level? Right. And it's like, no, sometimes you need to respect the fact that you've done something that regular, ordinary people don't do. And I don't think there's anything wrong with that. No, that's real. Um, I, I I agree with you. And this is my tenth year in New York, literally. That's a year. fucking accomplishment, yeah. bro. Um, um, I moved in um in June of ten ten years ago, and um, yeah. And you made it in one of the hardest cities ever. Um, right. you call this shit making it, nigga. That's I mean, I mean, bro, you, bro, you're I alive. Survived. You're alive. You're alive, my nigga. You're we here. Can, we can talk to you ten years removed from the first day you ever. And you can down. look. You can still drink. Yeah. You can still drink your shit. Whatever that shit is. That's yeah. some bullshit. Well, yeah, you well. drink some bullshit. So that was a personal attack on your character. That was no, no, yeah. that's a personal attack on that shit you drink. No, on his character. That was on my character. You said he drinks shit. That's what you're saying. I was trying to share a moment. Yeah, fact. No, you, but you I, made it negative. <laughs> and now I'm cutting ass. You see, no, no, I'm, I'm I, cutting ass. But now. I agree. Yes, it, 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 the reflection part of it it makes but, you yeah, man. it makes you it's, think about the things that you have done, and sometimes you forget the things that you have sacrificed to get to the point. This no, point. no, that, I, you know I, I agree. Saying? So I agree wholeheartedly, and not even. This, but like I said, going back to your whatever you you're happy and excited about. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's things in, that you thought about. And you'd be like, damn, <laughs> that's some shit. No, I, I, I did it. that, and now I'm here. Like I wouldn't. Who would have thought? Yeah. So, not to be so real. Shout out to that. Shout out to that. Imagine that. We didn't even think this would be what it would be. Bro, we, we was just junk in the bedroom talking we, shit on Facebook Live, bro. We started this shit off some bullshit. Yeah. That is a fact. And it Straight turned up. into a business. It That's turned crazy. into, yeah. So, if we're being honest, it turned it turned into a business. Yeah. We had accident. no clue what the fuck this was. On accident. And, we and, was just talking shit. That's wild. <laughs> and you know what's so funny? And I've now seen, we here. I've seen other shows that started are talking shit. Now we here. out oh, okay. here that are popular and they're going through. And they Start were friends doing the shit. same now shit we, we did, and they're going through tor- turmoil now. Now we here with the same amount Sorry, of time in- invested. Shit. Now <laughs> we here. I have a, no problem ignoring. <laughs> now we here. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Sorry. So, for us, I feel like for us to have done it for this period, this long period of time, and then to be at this point, is a testament to to the three of us in terms of how we communicate. Number one. Okay. How close we are. Number two. And thirdly, just oh, we getting emotional. No, that's just yeah, yeah. We getting how, emotional. How much I love y'all, man. How much we will? How much we know what the end goal is at the end of the day? We all may have different ideas on how to get there, but we know at the end of the day, this is what we want to achieve and reach. Mm-hmm. So because of that, we're all on the same page, and we're willing to say, you know what, nah, cool. My my idea may be a little crazy, maybe a little wild, maybe we don't need to do that. You're not trying to slide on a stripper pole from heaven to hell. <laughs> that's a crazy idea. I'm just I'm <laughs> no. And then no. dismount real clean, nah. and then and then break the devil and neck. start twerking on the devil. I'm cool. Okay, just check it. But I mean, shout out to us. For You're for opposed that. to it, but somebody is with it. No, hey, that shout out to you. Somebody I don't know. Out, <laughs> like, <laughs> <laughs> somebody <laughs> out here. We is laughing, with it. but they would be like, "Well, well, I had a conversation. How bad is it? Y'all know me. I will always have a conversation. I will always sit in the room and take the meeting." <laughs> like, I'm, I'll take the meeting. Like, I'm always willing to take the meeting. Nah, I'm always willing to take the Listen, meeting. It's you take the meat. Heard it. Okay. Little take that meat. I'm willing okay. to take the meeting. Devil dick. Okay. Heard it. Heard I just want to say, how far do I got to slide down the pole to get to the mm-hmm. bottom? Listen, mediator, moderator, <laughs> roll call, selective snitching, temporary lover, always toxic, half a gas station pill. We have one more. 
I don't read no books, Barry. <laughs> no, I know. Me. I read books. He no. don't read books. No, he no, do uh, audio books. He don't need the book. I don't need, he don't need the, the book. book. Got you. I don't need oh, no yeah, book, need, Barry. I don't yeah. need the book. I read books. <laughs> what are we talking about, Taz? Am I saying all of them? I'm picking one. Hmm. You gotta oh, tell you, the people what we talking you about. You the media. I mean, moderator. we kind of said what we talking about already. So oh, say it again. Right. Do I say it again? Why not? He always does. Well, Wade. For that. Wade, Wade is what? like, be normal. Yeah. What the? Wade is like, Wade. be regular. That's the next thing. Why Shout out to Wade. Different. He's been here for a long time, too. Shout out to, 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 Shout out to you, to, Wade. To, to the goat Wade. Uh, Wade, where's your mic? You had the mic set up. He oh, you forgot your mic? Damn he don't it, want Wade. it this week. Wade. Okay. We you need to like talking this In the middle, week. We need a microphone, Wade. We need it. But, uh. I'll get up. What are we talking about? Uh. 21 year old self, if you could give your 21 year old self advice right now, mm-hmm. what would it be? Gotcha. That's what we're going to talk about. That I feel like that's a real introspective okay. question to ask yourself. So okay. we're going to talk about that. Um, so, so we <laughs> so we tea. yes, and um, Justin LA. Justin LaBoy. I don't know how to pronounce his name. Is it LA Boy or LaBoy? LaBoy. I don't know. I, LaBoy? L- I Justin LA LaBoy. Boy. Okay. I think, I think um, LA Boy. I he has a know. show called Respectfully on Revolt TV. Shout out to them and their show. Shout out to Revolt TV. Shout out to Diddy for not picking us up. It's all good, though. Um, we'll get there. No, no, we're sure. Yeah, we'll get there, Diddy. Yeah, um, I, I, I'll approach it head on. You know what I'm saying? I, um, fuck you. They had Sweetie on their show. And on the show... <laughs> That's wrong. The co-host, Justin. The other uh-huh. co-host, co-host named Justin asked his a question. Son. His son. Gotcha. Asked a question saying, "Oh, do you take, do y'all take boyfriends out on shopping sprees? Take them out to eat or to dinner and stuff like that?" Okay. And the, her immediate response was, "Is why do boyfriends want to act like girlfriends?" So that's the question. So we gonna yes. talk about it. Okay. Why do boyfriends want to act like girlfriends? Mm. Yeah, we gonna talk about that. We definitely gotta talk about and that. And also, this is a topic that has been he has been going around camera. for a long, 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 long time. <laughs> Your way just put why is it camera. that pussy? <laughs> Sorry. Is the best gift to give a man when he is a good man. Say it again. I'm one sorry. more time. I was over talking. My bad. Why what? is pussy the best gift to give a man when he is a good man? A lot of times, men will provide. They'll 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 go to work. They will spend all their money on you. Give you whatever you need. You don't have to worry about anything, and you feel like the only thing that you should give him as a reward is pussy. Hmm. Why is pussy the gift to good men for being a good man? Hmm. Okay. I like that. No, I like that. Because I, I can, I can so. see that. Okay. So we're going to talk about that. You're doing that. everything that you do as a man. You're doing everything you're supposed Your to do as a man. Pussy. Yes. Okay. Mm. Or at least mm. that's how they feel. At least they give it. Okay, no, no. no right. I fuck with that. Mm. Oh, I want to play devil's advocate. Uh-oh. Can I? I want to play Wee. devil's advocate. Uh-oh. It's your you, 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 you always play devil's advocate. Can I play devil's advocate today? I mean, depending on okay. what y'all say. Cool, cool, Let's cool. Get it. I'm going to play devil's advocate today. So I hit the drop early, but I'm going to do it now again. Which one are you gonna pick? Watch you pick the whack one. Watch you pick the whack one. I was gonna say your shit. I feel like that's the whack one. It's not. I mean, but but it's okay. Wait, what, what did you say? Big topics, thing. That's true. All right, fair enough. What, what, We've cut shit? it down. Yes, nigga. So the topic was: What advice mm. would you give to your twenty-one-year-old? To self? your twenty-one-year-old self. Who wants to go first? Rock, pa- rock paper, scissors. Who do you want to go first? What advice what would advice? you give to your 21-year-old 21 self? 21-year-old self. Who want to go first? Rock, paper, scissors? I can spark it. Okay. I, I, I'm not afraid. I'm not afraid. 21. Um, my 21-year-old self, I would tell that young man. Right. Um, figure it out for yourself. Don't figure it out for a woman. Mm. After you figure it out That's for yourself, the women will come. That is some real shit. Sure. That's and that's bar. what I would say to my 21 year old son. That's a bar. That is a bar. That was a figure bar. it out for yourself. Right. And after you do that. Don't worry so much on. Because I, I can't speak for everybody that's watching it, all the viewers or whatever the case may be. Right. I, I grew up in an era where. That's real shit. Literally, like, you. <laughs> You you did for yourself. You had to put on for yourself, but you did it for someone else. For, you put yes. on the show to make sure that it would get the it's attention like, of someone else. You you right. have 
it's like the fucking peacock. I got I have to look the best to attract the of female. The so female. I, I need to have the most colors in my wings. I need to AKA have the, the most the big the fanciest car, the, the fanciest big, best sneakers, the biggest house. My thing is right. do the best for yourself and know that you got it for yourself, and that will translate later. Man, you know that, why that, that's my, you that's know why that advice. resonates with me so much? It's because I I was the opposite type of guy. Okay. I wasn't the flashiest. Okay. I wasn't the, 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 the you know, my shoes wasn't the best. My clothes wasn't the best. I yeah. didn't have the best car. Yeah. But I had, like. You're from Chicago, though. So no, it's, but it's, what I'm saying, but it's, it's, the same, it's the same level even there. It's always that guy that's flashy, that's, that's, that's yeah, fly, that right. got money, that got this and that. Where I resonate with you is exactly what you said, but kind of the opposite. So, like, yes, I believe don't, because my thing is I always let those things bother me. Mm. Because I didn't have, got you. You know what I'm saying? Like That's so, real. and then and and it was so strange to get older, and the girls was like, "Yo, you was cute the whole time. You it was didn't ta- I, yeah. I wanted like, I, if, if you call me, talk to me, like I'd have been like, fuck. And I was like, oh, I ain't shit, cause I ain't got shit. I I, I want to slightly interject. Talk to me. That only works when you and said woman said woman grows up. Because because at the when, time when she's said not woman like that. was 18, 19, she 20, wasn't she thinking wanted like, that. Right. She did. She wasn't thinking so that right. way. It only works when the both of y'all Facts. grow right. up Facts. and move in, in, in a similar yeah. direction together. So yeah, no, no. So so at 18, 19, that's why I tell y'all, like, I didn't have a whole lot of those experiences. Right, 18, right, right, 19. Right, right, right. I wasn't that dude. Like mm-hmm. I, I just wasn't. I was creating music and being the weirdo that I am. Yeah. But Around 24, 25, 26. When they caught up to you. Once they caught up, they was like, yeah. oh, my God. You're you was, amazing. You was dope the whole time. I wish I'd have been fucking with you, my baby daddy in jail. And I was like, yeah, but he was the fly, and, flashy and, and nigga. And now you got three kids. Right. Right. It's real shit. So, so, but I do fuck with that advice. Whistle. Because, if, like I say, being older, you stupid. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah, if I told, if I, yeah, like if that dude at 20, yeah. 21 would have known, oh, you going to be good, bro. Keep doing Fo- you, focus bro. Focus on yourself. Focus on what you're trying to do. <laughs> it's going to work. Yo. So wow. what would what, 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 what be, would be my advice to myself? Do you have That's advice crazy. that you would give yourself, Dame, or yet, or no? Mine is similar. You agree with me. No, no, but it's similar it, uh, because I didn't have a thing from what other people, but I was living a vision of what my mom had for me. Mm. Whew. So what would be your advice at 21? My think? advice is... Your mom being a strong black woman. What fuck what she, she talking about, bro. What she have for you? Fuck what she talking about. Mm-hmm. Wow. Yeah, no, in real life. And I mean this, seriously. Not not fuck my mom. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But fuck what she talking about. Because she just sees it from her eyes, mm. not your eyes. Mm-hmm. To be real, I tell y'all all the time, I wanted to move to New York in 2002, yeah. Back when music was different, yeah. the industry was different. The industry was here. I didn't want to go to college. It was here. Yeah, yeah. I wanted to come and sleep in studios at 19 and, and grind it out. And grind it out. Yeah. So by the time I'm old enough, it's like I've made it because I was that young kid. Because when you're a kid, you don't care. I sleep in the car. Back in the while, I sleep right here. And I don't give a shit. Mm-hmm. Now I'm older, so it's, it's weird. <laughs> but, right. but I was willing to sacrifice everything then. And my mama told me, no, get a job, go to college, right. do all of this. So me being 21, I'd have said, Fuck what you talking about, mom? I'm out, and I would have yeah. did it on my own. That would have been my advice now mm. to myself. Okay. That's valid. Yeah. What about yourself, sir? <laughs> uh, my advice probably for me would be: you are <clears throat> you are more than capable enough to do what it is that you wanted to do, and so stop doubting yourself. Wow. Mm. Right. Yeah. Because mm. a lot of times, people, I. For me, I've had people tell me that I can't do something all the time. And without without even realizing it, I did it, but it never resonated with me that I actually did what it is they said I couldn't do. It was just, I was just doing it because it's just like, you know what, I'm going to just do some shit. And then I, f- I did it. And now hindsight being 2020. Right. Oh, shit, Barry, you didn't motherfucker said you wasn't going to do that shit. Right, but right. It's not until now me being That's at the age life. I'm at. That I did the shit. So, bro, you a nigga tell you you can't do some shit. Tell that nigga no. Suck my dick. Yes, I'm gonna do the shit. Right. And do it being You're proud. So you gotta throw that in there. Suck my so dick. My dick. <laughs> no, but no, but legitimately, especially from a That's place hilarious. where we come from, people gonna tell you people people period gonna tell you that you can't do some shit. But in New York City right. specifically, you wanna do some shit that a million motherfuckers did already, and they tell you no, you can't do that. Now you, 
and it's gonna sound trivial. I'm gonna say it. Nah, you can't fuck that that girl. You can't. Nah, you can't. Right. Get no bread doing that. Nah, right. you can't do this doing that. Right. And then long and behold, yo, I fucked that girl. Yo, I I got bread doing it. No, I'm saying it in the most. <laughs> I was gonna most... give him a ding, but now it's like the shit just turned. <laughs> I'm like, shit? I said yo, it in Barry the most... fucked that girl, yo. The, he I'm fucked her. It... Ooh. <laughs> he I'm her, saying yo. it in the most. <laughs> I didn't I'm know that was gonna be way... the first one though. I I'm saying, <laughs> saying it in the most minute way so so it can yeah, so, could, so it can make whoa, whoa. sense because I get the point. I just didn't expect that. Because but it's real because I've been told in so many different forms. Yo, because I don't got no bread, I can't do this. Because yeah. you don't got this, you can't do that. So essentially, we all saying the same thing, but that's great advice. Yeah. So that's so the now. Can, I if I could flip it real quick, when you was twenty one, would you take it? Probably not. <laughs> Probably not. I'm gonna be honest with myself. No. It's, no. I, I, I would say yes. You would say yes. You would literally say no. My, my whole. Life, I would hear I, it, but it wouldn't. My whole life, I've, I've been the coachable one. Okay. I have been the one that can receive. Coaching and teachings from someone else, okay. and I'll, I'll adapt to it and okay. use it as my own. So I will say, also that's also me talking about me. So I can make me I sound know, amazing. I know, I know personally, I wouldn't be able to do it because I wasn't strong enough to hear that at the time. Wow. That's valid. Yo, that's wild because it's three different opinions. Um, I will admit, you are definitely coachable. I, I've coached them. Yes. You know what I'm I've yes. coached you, and, and I help, take it and, and I, help I you use it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, I do understand being too immature enough to get it. It's not even immature. Well, I don't know what the word is, but th the difference with me is I was too bullheaded enough to even hear you. You hear the difference like, of a like, fuck what you talking about, fuck, nigga? Like, like, fuck because because, about. because because I had I'm been there. Fuck you, nigga. I, what's see, up? see, and what I got, I had got early success <laughs> in music. Yeah. So I was already on the radio. Mm. It's like, oh wait, wait, you want me to listen to you? Motherfucker, are no, you man. on the radio, nigga? You hear what I'm doing? I'm, on a, I'm fucking demo, nigga. Like, fuck you talking about? So, no, I, you know, and I was bullheaded as fuck. When I said I was coming to New York, it was on some bullheaded shit. I'm the shit in Chicago, nigga. I'm going to go to New York and kill them niggas. <laughs> like, that's oh, got you. <laughs> that, that's what my attitude was. And you came here like. <laughs> I was like, oh, okay. Uh, I'm, <laughs> whew, uh, I ain't shit out here. Okay, okay. Uh, <laughs> Ten years mm -hmm. later, I'm like, I'm st uh, still learning. <laughs> But yeah, I know for a fact I would have never. Oh, I wouldn't have heard it either. I'd have, I'd have heard it, but it would have been one of them things that I wasn't ready for. Yeah, I, that's good. Though. I I personally think that if someone would have said this to me, I would I would have took heed. Uh, only I, be, only because I'd have been like, "Who is you?" Yeah, I <laughs> I, I didn't have that mentality growing I did. up. Oh I, man, I, I, I was I was cocky. I was o mad cocky. Only because I didn't reach the the level the plateau that you reached. I. Yeah. Bro, y'all see where I fucking come from, nigga. We talking about. I mean, but you see, but look how it look. We, 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 we talk about look at the dynamics, ass, right? Right. You had kids. you had too much, uh, you had too much confidence. Way too much. I didn't have enough. <laughs> and he, you him, was open. he was just I directly just in the middle. Made. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, so bro, it, it, it 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 works. No, at, it balances it But I think it it's cool because it shows three different attitudes. It shows yeah, right. that we all can learn and are open and willing to, you know what I'm saying? Not that but we that all comes can, with... we all will. Yeah. This life is going to humble the fuck out of you. Yeah. It takes right. time, man. No, yeah. li you no, really... Listen, this life is going to humble the Bruh. fuck out of you. You 100%. might think that you're amazing. Guess what? Life is going to tell you otherwise. <laughs> Yo, one thing my mother, <laughs> you, one thing my mom told me. this out real quick. Bro, one you thing think, my mom told me. You think you the shit? Mm. Okay, I got something for you. Life don't lose any fights. Bro, I remember, ever. I remember coming so, from. We literally was headlining shows in Chicago. We were the headliner. People came out to see us, my group at the time. Yeah. And so me and my boy move out here, and we think, you know, we walk in, we're us. <laughs> Yo. Them niggas would be like, oh, you want to perform? Yeah. Oh, okay. That's what you want to do? Yeah. Okay. You got, you got your entrance fee? <laughs> yeah. I was like, well, I'm Damo. They was like, uh-huh. Who the fuck is that? <laughs> Sign up here. And I look, I'm like, I'm number 22. Yeah. You know, 22 don't perform at 2.30 in the morning. Facts. You performing for the fucking janitors but after and the hearing, bartenders. But after hearing 21. After hearing 21 motherfuckers. Acts. Yeah. Yo, yeah. mind you, I'm out there doing the same show that was headlining in Chicago. Yeah. But in New York, it's a you number vibe. 22, bro. It's a different vibe. <laughs> like, so, yeah. And that shit humbled the fuck out of me, man. Yeah. Wow. I mean, but the number one thing that we've all seen. And time they charged me my money to do it. Motherfuckers. <laughs> Tom beats I us up. Eight hundred to get into that show, like fuck y'all. Tom beats us up, but at the same time, time has also taught us that you know what, you can grow and learn and, and become better. Yeah, I agree. Mm -hmm. With 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 all obstacles and yep. situations. So shout out to that. 
And we can now take the same knowledge that we have learned and hopefully spread it to our young offspring. Ding, 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 motherfucking right. ding. That's the, that's the key. That's the number one thing, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> the reason, to be honest, the reason why the black community is so far behind, mm. we, we didn't have the opportunity, and this is real shit, we didn't have the opportunity to learn and fail from situations. Right? And because we never had that... Talk to me about that. What do you mean? We didn't have a man to tell us, yo, bro, it's... Don't, don't We've always know. been property. Okay. We've always been just something that... We're, we're, we're something that was acquired. Mm. We, we, we were never able to sit and experience and learn without interference mm-hmm. how this works so that we could make it work for us. We're now doing that. Mm. My mom is first generation. So is mine. You feel me? His mom is first generation. Gotcha. So we're the descendants of somebody who just came to this fucking country. No, technically we're not first generation. We're first generation. Yeah, we're the first generation offspring. They're, they're, so they're still... So we're learning from people who have no connections, no ties. They don't know nobody. We're here trying to make it work for ourselves, pretty much. And we can't even blame them for, for getting to it's, the point that they're at because they didn't know any it's better. It's not a blame. They have no choice because we're descendants of slaves. So, so what they got to from where so they at, from they was, is some shit, man. What I'm trying to say is like, is it's a, it's a, it's it's a real reason why the average income for a white family is like quadruple that of a black family. Okay. The average income for us is like eighteen grand. The average household income for them is like a hundred and seventy. Right. And it's 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 it's, it's a thing. Um, when when everything is in place for it to be that way and for you to have that, of course you would prosper from it. Us, we have to figure it out. So now we're here like, yeah, my Jamaican mother, I'm sorry, my Antiguan West Indian mother, his Jamaican mother. They have to figure it they out. They have to figure it out so that they're first generation kids. We can now do something with what they quote unquote figure it out, which and, was nothing. And then what makes it it's I don't wanna make and thing. what makes it harder is they will learn something, but not saying that they won't share the information, they don't know how to share the information. Because it's, it's, it's because new news to them. Because it's new news to them, one and two, remember women I always say a woman can't raise a boy to become a man. It sounds crazy, it sounds rough, but it's the truth. I agree. You know what I'm saying? So for a mother, she can't, she won't be able to, to, to say to a young man, hey, listen, fam, just get to this bag, get to this money. Don't worry about all these women out here. They're going to come no matter what. I ain't going to want to hear nothing my mom talking about after a certain point because my mom not going to get it. My mom don't want me to be out here chasing no girl like that. She's not going to understand the thrill of a man trying to get some pussy. But daddy wasn't there. But because my pops wasn't there, I have no other. I have no other way of... Understanding, so the only thing I'm hearing my mom say is, "Oh, these girls, they too fast, they too fast." Whereas your pops will say to you now, "No, nah, I know Shorty fire, bro. Don't worry. But listen, hey, you get to this bag real quick. Shorty's gonna be on your body. She's gonna be more fire." So now, when my pop, if a pop said that to me, it'd be like, "Oh shit, not for nothing." My pop said that shit to me. That's lit. Now I know what time it is from Rip. No, I get it, but we also don't have that because of mass incarceration. And because <laughs> of a whole bunch of, of other mad things. other shit that stopped that's us from so. having that. Hmm. But you know what? But other people had that. I'm not even gonna focus on that now because we it's, are now it's here. A, and it's we an can't. interesting. It's an interesting topic to me, being that I'm not Caribbean. Yeah. Um, being you're, a, you're not first generation Caribbean, West yeah. Indian. No, right. not at all. Um, my people are descendants of American slavery. Yeah. From the South, Arkansas, um, Arkansas, Mississippi, and Tennessee. That's some country shit. Yeah. So it's, it's it's interesting always hearing like the Caribbean experience. Um, they literally come from nothing. I mean, but I, I, I'm I, not saying yet. I, I think no, I, I don't want to get into the whole back and forth on who struggle was worse than other people. Struggle is struggle. I don't want to say struggle is struggle. No matter where you struggle is struggle. Yes. The only thing I can say that I think that's cool about Caribbean culture that I don't see that much in in. I guess African American culture, if you want to call it that, because mm-hmm. I feel like African Americans too. Yeah, yeah we you are. Understand what I'm which, saying? Which we are. Slaves, America, it, whatever, yeah. right? I get it. Is that I like that the Caribbean culture built a system to where you can you can help each other a little bit. 
You know what yeah. I'm saying? Oh, you talking about partner and Susu? And Susu. All of that. Susu, the I, co- community raises the community. I do like that. Yeah. Because that is something that I can say that, you know, African American descendants of slaves, whatever you want to call this shit. Yeah. The, the, the term now, they call it foundational black Americans. Get the fuck out of here. Well, we'll talk about that. I want to get into that. Foundational? Yes. Leave because it alone. That's what they said? Yeah. No, wait, hold on. Let me go. You want to get into it? No. Okay. I, just never heard it I agree before. with the no. I never heard it before. It's called, it's called FBA, but I, I, I Get can explain the why. Fuck out of here. But I can explain why. Wow. I can explain why. Because it's the people that built the country so that the people can migrate over here. No, seriously. Seriously. And so it's it's literally it's oh, it is that the, just angered me. But see, it, and that's why I said that's why I, said, I don't want to compare, you know, I don't want to get into that. Because mm-hmm. that's that's something we can talk about afterwards. Yeah, okay. Please. But trying to define yourself. That you know, that's what it is. It's like well, we the people that help build the country. You know, first, so now you can come here and and, and we work on it together mm. as people. Understand that we're all the same people. But how do you define that people that was here? That's what they called it. So just you know, whatever. But wow. point I'm trying to make is, um, I love meeting y'all. At the end of the day, it's been an amazing experience. Mm-hmm. Um, mm-hmm. Seriously, and we were just talking, reflecting what we tell ourselves as young people. If I'd have known that I would move here, if I'd have known for real that I would meet y'all, motherfuckers, like, I, yo, I, hell of a blessing. It's great. Even Marlon Punk ass. To Even be honest, Marlon. You, you, <laughs> you know what else I would tell myself? Yeah. I would tell myself to invest in Google. Nigga, <laughs> what? <laughs> invest, what? Invest in Bitcoin. God damn it. Invest in Tesla. Everything in Facebook. Nigga, oh, invest in it Facebook. Is, what? Invest in MySpace. What? Nigga. I mean, like, yo. I would be a quajillionaire. If I can go back yeah. in time. Yeah. T- you remember when the crackhead from around the corner at T-Mobile was like, yo, buy Bitcoin. I don't remember that. But it was, I'm it pretty sure it in. happened. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it happened. I remember uh, Shaq, Shaq said that he was at a at a weird-ass gala or event or some and shit. somebody told him to invest. And he was fucking Google. around with the little boy. You know how you be making faces yeah. with the little kids? Pulse, pulse, no, playing pulse. with a little kid. All right, all right, all right, crazy. all right. It that came out wrong. crazy. It came Fire. out wrong. Fire. That was crazy. We've all been making faces and making jokes with the kid, and they laughing and shit, and that's all he was doing. Got you. Okay. All right, that's okay. it. Nothing okay. weird. Okay. Relax. Mm. <laughs> you just said Shaq was... I did, yeah, fucking yeah, with a little kid. Yeah, fuck Shaq My bad. And so what happened was, I don't know if it was Amazon or if it was Google. It was but Google. It was Google. Yes. And he was like, he was just, you know, making jokes with the little kid. And then the, the guy was like, man, you're so good with my kid. And he was like, yeah, I love kids. You know, whatever. He was like, well, I got this company. <laughs> Would you? And Shaq gave him a million dollars. Yes. Google. Yes. So Shaq was like, when Google hit. <laughs> I hit. <laughs> I'm one of the original investors. Yeah. <laughs> what? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nah, I would have so, definitely. 21 listen, year old man. Dan would have been Shout investing. out. Shout out to, to, to us and our 21-year-old selves. Shout you remember the Eddie. first version of Snapchat before it like, caught on? Eh, no. No? The first version Snapchat of Snapchat. was the same. No, it was still Snapchat, but it was when it wasn't, hadn't hit yet. What I'm saying is I would have been one of those people who, looking back, I would have always tried to invest in what's next. Yeah. yeah. Listen, to any 21-year-old that's listening now, please take heed to anything that we said. Because I feel like we dropped some gems. Look, tag somebody twenty one, goddammit. You know, legit. <laughs> so tell them to subscribe to to the YouTube. Valid. And and listen to to some of the shit that we talking about, men and women. It don't matter who, who whatever you identify as. I feel like I. F- okay, this is going off a little bit, but I feel like they've done such a good job of dividing us. Mm-hmm. Like. The, They've done an amazing job of dividing us. And no mm-hmm. matter what we say to mm-hmm. bring us together, we'll never be together. That's it. Because no, even if all guys are on the same page, it's going to be us against women, right? Right. It's like, I, I fucking for the other topics. We're still black. Uh-huh. Right. We're still black people, and we're still right. trying to make it happen. But because there's men and there's women, it's divisive, right? Cool. Mm-hmm. And then you have another section and another section going at it within the black community. So that's the more divisive. I feel like no matter what happens, we're just going to be divided. And that's more good advice. No, but we need to fix that. How the fuck? Like, I don't it, know. It, it's I, I don't it's have okay an answer, to give advice, but can we give a solution? I don't know. One? I don't have one right now. I don't. So that that's where I think that we fail. Mm-hmm. And it's not it's not on us to save everybody. I get it. We're, we're not here to be the saviors of the black race. Right. But I want I do. I, I would like to give a solution every now and then. That maybe we can solve a problem that plagues our people. I don't, we need to I give don't solutions. know one right now. But we know the world fucked up. We yeah. get it. Yeah. Can we offer something? We can think about it. 
Just think so about that, it. That, that's where I'm at with it. We need, it. we need to offer something. All right. Time to move on? Yes, sir. We can do that. Let's do it. Oh, wait, how about this? I'm a challenge. Hello, Wednesday. Hey, man, put it there. Cut it. I'm I'm a challenge Cut it. all of the um the, the <laughs> viewers and the followers and everybody who pressed the like and share and subscribe button. Uh let's find some answers. Let's try and figure this out. Yes. Put it mm-hmm. in the comments below. Let's let's find some answers on how we can be more together and, and unified. push us forward. I don't know. Um cool. Next topic is Willow Wednesday. Wednesday. Yeah, hey, man, drops. Uh Play the clip. Do boyfriends want to be the new girlfriends as we go to the clip? I don't know. Depends on the situation. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Most respectful way. One mic, one mic, one mic, one mic. I'm too proud. Sweet stuff. First of all, ladies, don't ever be scared to ask for no money. Period. Okay. Because, like, it's hard to I mean, it's just, we're women and we got How coochie. You First, coochie. But second of all, respectfully. <laughs> respectfully, respectfully, you always gotta be cute about it though, you know? Like, you know, babe, I need some groceries. I wanna go shopping. Yeah. Mm. You gotta set it up nice and cute. Yes. Do y'all take y'all man shopping though? Like, is he supposed to just take y'all shopping? Like, do y'all get nice things or like? Why do why do boyfriends wanna be treated like girlfriends? They gotta be oh! So that's where we at. We talking about? Why do boyfriends want to be treated like girlfriends? Fellas, mm. my panel, my brothers, my brethren. You think you my think... right hand and right left people. Let's ask the let's ask the right question first. Do you think that men uh, you can't ask a question with a question? I'm asking y'all. So don't do that. You can't ask a question with a question. My question to y'all is what she posed. Do boyfriends want to be the new girlfriends? <laughs> Real shit. Do we want to be the new girlfriends? Do we? I'm mad because my answer is so a question much? too. <laughs> my you, answer is a question. You cannot ask a question uh, with a question, or no, you can't answer a question with a I question. I feel like if we're going based off of the premise of what she's been saying, what yes, saying, yeah. we do for sure because oh, right. we're at we so as men. So boyfriends want to be the new girlfriend. Yes, because we're demanding gotcha. more from women. Huh? What, no, what does that mean? I'm sorry, I'm confused. Okay, so because we, she we said have... in the in the clip that you played, she said that ladies don't be scared, ever scared to ask for money. Ask yes. for money, okay. And then I don't know if y'all heard what she said. She said because we got coochie. Yes. So because she said that to me, I take it as if a man says, "Hey, babe, do you can you take me shopping?" or or a man is looking for a woman to take her shop. A man is looking for his woman to take her shopping or do anything financial for him, mm-hmm. I feel like we're demanding a little bit more from her than just pussy. Okay, so in, in your argument... Based off of what she's saying. The reason why I don't agree with your argument... Why? There's two different valuations of coochie and dick. Mm-hmm. Coochie does cost more than dick. If we're being honest. This leads into his topic. And but it leads into mine. But let's stay no, with no, we'll no, stay no, with no, yours. What, let's what stay I, with the boyfriend girlfriend thing. Yes. If you go boyfriend girlfriend, we're talking about a man and a woman. Organs or a woman's do organs. Do men want to be the female? Do do men I, boyfriends want to be the girlfriend? I, I feel like the reason why we will forever lose mm-hmm. if you go across the plane in earth, okay. Vagina costs more than dick. And because vagina is is more of a cost than dick, we but were, why though? We will forever lose. But why though? When men, I mean, why we, women outnumber men? So why is it that they cost more when there's less? Because of we us? we put. I'm gonna take a shot. I'm sorry. We put a bad bitch on a pedestal. We do. And men and women don't put us on pedestal. He cheat. He's trying to drink more. <laughs> no, 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 what I'm saying is, we put them on a pedestal. It's something to get. Yeah. Right, I right, right. The bad joint. Yeah, I gotta. They don't do that for us. They don't. So we put the vagina on a pedestal. Mm. 
And because of that, they win and we lose. That's what I'm trying to say. It, it's like a... If, 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 that, if that is the ultimate goal, that is the pinnacle, that's the highest point, that's the plateau, we, we can't get no higher than that, that would be vagina for us. Sorry. Watch your mouth. Watch your mouth. <laughs> I'm not going to see the B word no more. <laughs> but, that was um, disgusting. For those tuning in, we don't say the B word on Willow Wednesdays. And if you do, but you got to take a nasty shot. The thing shot. is, right, I'm but, going based off of the premise of the video, right? Okay. It comes off, in my interpretation. That's disgusting. My interpretation of it, it comes Watch off. Watch your mouth. It comes off as if Shorty is saying, like. Want some I'm, juice? I'm, I do. <laughs> Go ahead. A man. A man getting doubted on a girl taking him shopping or whatever the case may be seems like it's 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 a female thing for a man to expect that or or to get that from a woman right so like i said i don't think it's go ahead i, I don't want to cut you off in 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 We've respect to the that. conversation it the other co-host when he asked that he's like yo so do you not saying that a man shouldn't do that. Of course a man should do that. But do you reciprocate the emotion right. or the feeling or the you action? You do something for your man. You take him shopping. Do you and immediately, as soon as he sh- he said that, doing something for somebody, why is it that men want to be, why is it that boyfriends want to be girlfriends? So, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. She go ahead. Did, she, what I didn't like about what was said was that the same dude that asked her the question was the same dude was like, I understand, you know, kind of like, yeah, you got a bad chick. She, that's your girl. You spoil her. You buy things. And there's nothing wrong with spoiling your so, girl. So they agreed there. Cool. But then he said, well, can, we can play, you... Re- can we play it again? Oh, okay. Sure. But he basically asked her, can you reciprocate? And, and then as what soon she, as she, she said that... As soon as she did, she went to diminish who the man is. She's like, oh, why oh, you, you got a girlfriend now? So like, why... Really? So I, I just want to play it one more time, just, just for my, myself personally. Oh, my First of all, ladies, don't ever be scared to ask for no money. Okay. Because, like, it's hard I mean, it's just, we're women and we got How coochie. First, mm-hmm. But second of all, respectfully, <laughs> respectfully, respectfully, you always got to be cute about it, though. You know? Like, you know, babe, I need some groceries. I want to go shopping. Yeah. But mm. You got to set it up nice and cute. Yeah. Do y'all take y'all man shopping though? Like, is he supposed to just take y'all shopping? Like, do y'all get nice things or like? Why do Why do boyfriends want to be treated like girlfriends? Now? They gotta be oh! You see now? Off, it comes off as soon as he says, "Hey, oh, I'm not, I'm not saying what you're saying." You saying respectfully, that's what's up. I, I fucks with that. But, but as soon as he says, "Do you?" But if I'm like, "Yo, do you, do you take me shopping?" And she like, "Oh, now you a girlfriend?" You see what she just did? She okay. just diminished the man. She she did, I, and I'm not disagreeing with you. She deflected like a motherfucker. She basically that's, made... That's grade and that's A what, deflection. And, and, that's what, and that's what I was alluding to. And that's to. what we're asking. So you're a girlfriend... For, for wanting the same energy you for give your, out? For, your, for, for wanting the same energy that you give... Yes, yes, yes. 100%. For the same energy, bro? Seriously? So your I, wife doing something for you that makes you the wife and make her the husband? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, and I know your wife gets you stuff sometimes. That makes you the, the girl, bro? That makes so now you the... Your, your wife did some dope <laughs> shit for your birthday. No, 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 no. Let's break it down. I'm, I'm your wife I'm did listening, some listening, dope I'm shit listening. for your yes, birthday, right? Your birthday was dope. That was makes there. you a girlfriend. So you the girlfriend? Legitimately, yeah. by the standards of what she's saying, her doing that for you is... That's the question. Well, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Nigga just agreeing no, with everything. Saying, no, I'm, I'm no, I'm not. saying... He was what? talking. You're talking. I'm like, what the fuck? Like, her doing, that's the question. I'm like, nigga, what? what? Her doing what... Your wife doing what she did for you for your yes. birthday, right? Yes. Did all of that. The bread. The, 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 the all spot. The gifts. Yes. All that. The people. Yeah. The yep. friends. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You are now a girlfriend now because she did that. You a wife now. You Do a wife. I agree with that? No, I don't. <laughs> but that, so that's what the question but is. But that's what the question is because if you go off of the premise of what she's saying, as soon as Sun said... He didn't say, nah, fuck that nigga shouldn't be doing that. All he right. said was, yo, like... Do you do, do the you, same do thing? Do you take your man shopping? Like, do you buy him nice things? She's like, oh, they so want to be girlfriends I'm, I'm now. Cool. So, so I, I'm, I'm going to tell you where the disconnect may be happening, right? Talk to me. Um, there's the traditional man, and then there's the new school man, mm-hmm. right? The traditional man may see a situation where I have to be the provider. I'm going right. to do this. I'm going to do that. No matter what. Oh, right. my God. He the new school man is going to be like, I don't have to fucking do that. Like, we're here together. We're both right. living this life together. Whatever I go through, you, you go through. We're going to split this half and half. You about yeah, to get yeah. me upset. You about to get me upset. I, I, how can I get you upset? It's, it's you just the mindset. What I'm, what I'm saying is, 
there's two different types of man, and it's a real thing yeah. mm-hmm. out here. Yeah. There's a nigga that's willing to pay for whatever, whenever, All however. All the time, no matter what. No matter what. He got it. He was he taught that. To. Yeah. That's how he that's that's how mm-hmm. he shows his love. Yeah. And then there's a man that's like, I hear what I hear what that guy is saying, but that's not me. Shout out the dude. We're gonna split this. Right. Um, I'm not gonna go through no bullshit, and you're gonna go through everything peachy clean, and we're gonna but, make it. But the problem, I, feel, I, I, I you oh, can't I say but. I didn't finish. You're right. Go ahead. What I'm saying is, we're we're literally dealing with the fact of if the shoe doesn't fit, don't fucking wear it. And what happens is we get to this point where we get so fucking butthurt about shit that doesn't affect you. If that's not your life and it's not you, then oh well. But, they, but if it but, is your life and it does affect you, but, then defend. But it. that's not the problem. But that I get you're right with that. But mm-hmm. the problem now I is I with you there. If it don't if, if it doesn't bother you, why the fuck you are true? I get that, the but the problem. But this is where the problem comes into play, okay. right? A lot of women that you are courting or dating are taking up this philosophy, the same thought pattern and thought. So process. why are you courting or dating them? Because all of them are. Because di- you want a but woman, nigga. Because Sweetie's a top rapper. So, no, 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 so no Willa, you can't no, do that. No, no. So she's influencing a lot out of, of the women. women that you want. There's millions of women listening to this. Like, yes, yes exactly. You're right. C- cool. Yeah. But, so, so, so. But it's like, so your boyfriend. Wait, ain't- wait, 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 wait. So if you're gonna bring up Sweetie, I can, I can now bring up Quavo, right? Okay. So if you were talking about Sweetie, mm-hmm. right? I'm a Quavo. What the fuck you talking about? I'm at the top of my game. I'm the, I'm the it nigga. I don't give a fuck what you're talking about. Got you. So okay. fuck what you're talking about. But he's allowing I'm the it. it nigga. But but the, but but, 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 but it's not about you, you being the but it nigga. But she's even clowning him. But but listen. And so is he. But no, Willa, we're talking about in terms of the conversation. Let me know right? if I'm wrong. I'll shut up. <laughs> I'll shut because up. Because at the end of the nah, day, he's a. What I'm saying is yes. He's at a point where he can do all of the things that she's talking about. Financially, which is fine. Which is fine, 100% yeah, sure. granted. But okay. we're talking about the mindset of it, right? You said the mindset two, of who? Of women and men. You said there are two Better different... Better in Saweetie's position? The thing no, is, it's not the thing even is, about wait, wait, being... Wait, 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 but I got it, I got it. But no, that's, I got why, it. That's, that's why I have to break it down. No, I got it. Wait, wait, no, no, wait, no, no, I got it, I got it, I got it. But the reason why it's important is that the women who's taking up this philosophy is ain't not in Sweetie's position. position. Got you. And that's what I'm <laughs> trying to allude to. Got so you, right? what I'm trying to say is they're in that position. That's valid. Women who are... You're talking to regular chick that work at Target having the same attitude. Right. Whoa, don't downplay the regular chick that No, we're not downplaying her, but you can't... No, because somebody going to try and cancel us later. They're going to try and cancel us. cancel What I'm trying I work at Target, Dave. <laughs> like, but what I'm saying is, you can't be the per- you. It makes all the girls want to be that, and so now when you meet a reg or you married, but whatever, you out. Let's say don't you wasn't. do that to me, bro. But what I'm saying, if you was out regular, boom, mm. in a club, meet a chick. How you yes, doing? My yeah. name is this. Her name is that. She's like, word. You about to take and give me everything because based on what Sweetie told me, you need. And it's like, whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, ma'am. No, because hello, it's, Jason. Uh, it is, I'm I just met rude. you. It's sis, a fact. Uh, you wanna Jason. Know? I'm Jason. You're Jason now. Jason. Bro, Jason. You, you could have just let it pass. No, nah, I can't. I can't. <laughs> Every time you say that, hurt it. Oh go ahead. God. Go ahead. Butt hurt. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. My point is, mm-hmm. you said that there are two t- different type of men, right? There's one that's that that's he grew up as a provider. This yeah. is what I do, and then there's a new age man where he's like, I hear you, right? But this is not what I'm about. I feel like the problem is women want to be. A new age woman and an old age woman at the same time. Oh shit, Barry preaching. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. You can't be both, sis. You cannot be both. That's a valid point. A valid you know what I'm saying? Point. You wanna, you wanna get to the bag. You wanna do this. You wanna. Be a millennial. Oh, I don't wanna be a traditional woman. Be in the house, just cooking, slaving, right. washing clothes, taking care of kids. Right. But at the same time, you want a man to to, to doubt on everything. you, spoil you, right. pay all of the bills. Cause I get, I get a woman not wanting to be home and just that's it and. Just all of her life is catered to the home. I understand that because nobody wants to live like that. Right. However, you can't now sit here and say, you borderline make as much money as me, sis. Right. Your OnlyFans popping. You know what I'm saying? You, how you, you borderline could possibly like make more you, bread than me. You, <laughs> you sell your feet on the on OnlyFans and you probably make the same amount of bread as me. Right. And you still want me to pay all your bills. And then you want me to pay all of your bills, pay all of my bills. But then yet still, when I ask you to, to, to cook me a meal... Oh no, I'm not. That's not how I give it up. That's not my type of time. You could cook me every once in a while, but when you don't feel like doing it, you don't feel like doing it. So that's what I'm saying. My thing is, you, and it's it a, cannot. It's a, it's, you it's cannot one more step to that. be both. It's one more it step to that. It's that when she, when you want to be spoiled a little bit too, 
it makes you look like a the girlfriend. Corny girlfriend. That's crazy. So now you're the girlfriend. That's what I'm saying. That's the question. So it can't be both ways. So I, we know how it go. Mother's Day, people go all out for Mother's Day. Father's Day, for those who have fathers, you get a tie. But this is what this is the next thing I was gonna say, right? Well, homemade. That's a fact. See, you get the, you get macaroni. You get a homemade macaroni thing that says well, "Happy is, Daddy." But this is where I love your daddy. Made out of macaroni. I know because I made them in school. But I, I, you, you had the macaroni, the macaroni I'm card. Get, I may get in trouble for this. No, it's amazing. It's amazing. No, 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 no. Shout to my son. I love that shit. No, don't, don't do, come on, Wade, don't do don't that. Do don't that. Do that. <laughs> nah, because when I made my daddy his macaroni shit, I was like, uh, I'm gonna kill this. My daddy gonna love this macaroni card. It's <laughs> lit. <laughs> like, nah, fuck that. I felt great. <laughs> like, it's bullshit. But, but that in comparison to how you feel about your mom is always different. So oh, that's a fact. That's so, a fact. So with kids, you know, or not kids, with well, girlfriend and boyfriend, it's kind of the same thing. I was she gonna like, say we can get this nigga macaroni and. <laughs> I was he gonna, gonna give me a fifteen hundred dollar purse. What I was gonna say, right? You know that I I may get in trouble for this, but I feel like as men, you about to cuss? No, 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 no I'm not about to cuss. <laughs> get the shot ready. So back on the way. Listen, that shit hurt. We gotta <laughs> we hurt. we as men in those in that position, if we're able to do and have those things, and we have a new age woman, we right. have to start holding her to a certain standard, mm. right? Okay. Granted, you could be a man as yo, I want to provide for my woman, right? All of these wonderful, great things, which is dope. There's nothing right. wrong with that as a man. I don't see anything wrong with it. But now you can't... If she's unwilling to now give you the things that you require or need, no. You need to stop dealing with her or have a conversation. And once you have that conversation, hold that conversation to that standard of whatever it is you had to agree I upon. would not date a woman that is not willing to do something for me. Period. Because to me, when I heard that, I, I swear to God, when Period. I heard that... It's like I felt like yo. I should say like them. Period. You know what I mean. That that, that period that shit. Don't you that that period shit is. Period. I fucking hate this shit. Yep. It's not. It's not. It's not. I felt weird. And it's saying fine. It. I even did the hand. Hearing it. Period. Hearing it. I, is I even annoying. did the hand shit. shit. But I feel like <laughs> as men, we need to start <laughs> holding them to a certain standard because if at any point in time, I say this all the time. Any point in time, as a man, you're lacking. Mm. Voice voice your op- opinion, women. There's nothing wrong with that. I 100 percent agree. But now, as a man, you see these opi- you see these red flags. And we don't say, and we say something. Oh, you want to act like a girl now? No, hold her to the standard, like how she holds you to the standard. She holds you to the standard of paying her phone bill, my nigga. On the first, the bill is due. It, the payment is due. Cool. You don't miss a date on time. T-Mobile bill. She's a credit class A. Now, sis, I'm hungry every fifteenth and the thirtieth. I don't feel like cooking. No time out. What, what are we talking about here? Hmm. I disagree. I'm, I just use that as an example. Uh-oh. I'm just using Uh-oh. that as an example. Why? Uh oh. Me be, me being the man that I am. I, I, okay. I'm just not looking. I'm not gonna go above and beyond. Not even above and beyond. I'm, I'm not gonna do something that needs to be done. Right. In the hopes that you do something that I. I that's not what I said. That's, no, that's not different. what I said. No, that's, that's different. That's not what I said. I did not say that. That's a little different. Because that's you That's you doing something, trying to get, get something. something. And that's not what I ever that's said. Different. That's different. What I'm saying is I wouldn't date the type of woman that wouldn't do something for me. Because the moment he... Because all son said is, yo, would you just take your man out shopping? All, all he said was, yeah, if you're would doing you, this... Would you just take Would your you do that for him? him? That's then all not, of a sudden you all type of girlfriends. Wait, I agree with that. What? That statement that she has said to that point was stupid as shit. But that's what we're trying to but, say. And that's what that I'm alluding. I'm just fuck. expounding upon it, bro. So, so that's what we're cool. saying. So okay. once again, just to make it clear, that's the thing that these little girls are hearing. And they're like, he do stuff don't, for me. Don't call them little girls. No, no it's no, the no. truth. I'm not talking you, about... Dame I'm, is old as shit. He can call them all yeah, little girls. Yeah, you said little girls? Yeah. Are, yeah. But they 30 and you 80? Everybody younger than me. But what I'm simply trying to say is... What she's teaching the people who follow her is like, well, he must do things for you. And if you do something for him, he's, he's a girlfriend. He's feminine. And that's what I'm like, nah. And I, I would not want... Oh, cool. I agree 10,000%. And I would not date a woman that doesn't do things for me. Cause because I do it's not about her. me. Because let's be fair. You as do a, things for your wife, right? Yes. But I don't do... 
You don't do it looking for validation. But not or, looking or, for. Or, it's, it's not even looking. But if she it. never did nothing, bro, you would be all right with that? Come on, son. Yes, because I, I don't go looking for nah, it. Nah, dog, but, but it's but, like... But that okay, cool. No, that's, that's a different that's, conversation. So, so, cool. so, so that's I, the convo. I, I, I would say this. I would hang my hat on the fact that I'm not like you. I'm Fair not enough. gonna do something repeatedly thinking or hoping or wishing that she did something in, no. in, in reciprocation. No. I'm just gonna do this because that's what I'm gonna do. That's not what I'm saying. If you never do something, it's okay. It's not gonna bother me. That's not okay. That, Jason, I'm gonna be. So, I'm gonna. So, I'm gonna wait, be real wait. With you. So let, wait, let me just okay go. I, I let y'all talk for minutes. What, what, I'm, what I'm saying is, you can do something, and you would think after a certain amount of time of me doing something, I need something else, right, to validate what what you're doing. Am I wrong? I, I'll shut the fuck up from right here. Let me know if I'm wrong. Can you repeat that? Cool. You're doing something for someone. Okay. You need that someone to do something for you to feel like, okay, it's cool now. Everybody does. I don't give I a think, fuck. I think, every, I think everyone. Person. I don't business. Cool. So, 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 so let me go. What I'm saying is me yeah. personally, okay. I could do something for you as my lady, as my woman, and I will never require anything to be done back to me. Wait, let me finish. I wasn't going to say a word. I and I would still be okay is what I'm trying to say. I don't want. I don't give a fuck what the fuck you do for me. I'm not doing what you do for me as a validation for me to do something for you. I'm not living that life. So, so to to to, to double back on what he said, because I'm just saying what he said. What Damo said was, if I'm gonna be doing all this for you, you need to do something for me for it to be okay. Am I right or wrong? Shut up. Am I right or wrong? That's what he said. He said that. Yes. So I'm, I'm, but I'm asking him so we can make this point. Am I right or wrong? You took it out of context. He said, but can I, can I, can I go? Wow. Please? You took it out of context. Right? So now. Dame, what you literally, what you no, literally would. That's what I said, but because I wasn't. That's able, what he said. He just said you said it. No, cool. no. I said it. Yes. But because I wasn't able to expand on it. Right. We took it as face value. So now. So fine. If you just want to take me as face value, well, cool. What I'm going to say is, you said. I'll, I'll, you said I'll shut up. I'm sorry. You said, you will have said. I didn't um, get to explain that. You don't do anything requiring your partner to, to give you anything in return. That's what you said, right? Because I do it out of the kindness of my right. heart. No, no, absolutely. I'm not, and I'm not saying you cool. I'm not disagreeing with that point. However, just because you don't require it doesn't mean that you wouldn't like it to be done. There's a dip, there is a major difference in that. Now, if you were to sit there and nothing was, you would just be but out. But that changes the argument. No, it does not. No, it, it, it does. Because now, now what you're saying is, what would I like opposed to what is happening? But that's, that is literally the conversation this that is, we're having. But this is the reason why I say I wasn't able to break that's, it down. That's, no, I don't, I don't like that. Because, I wasn't able to break because it down. Because remember, like in the, wait, 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 wait. In the, wait, wait, wait. That's, no, because he didn't make in a the, point from what you said. Wait, no, but he did. Wait, what's the, I said I never bro, got a chance to explain Because you got to remember, in the I'll beginning of the, in the video, Sun didn't say, yo, you have to. Not have. Not require. He said, yo, he didn't say you require to. He said, to. would you? He said, randomly. oh, would you? And she was like, oh, it's oh you, you remember, a girl now. It's words. Yo, <laughs> like, the nigga what? ain't say, yo, nah, you got to get your man some shit, too. He just said, yo, would you would you just do some shit for your man? Not saying, yo, because your man blow the bag on you. He was just like, yo, bro. cool, that's respectfully, that's a fact. Ask your man for some bread. Tell that man to take you shopping. Yeah, agree. Buy you some groceries. Cool, yo, would you, would you do, do anything for would him? Would you do nice something nice for your man? <laughs> she was like, oh, he a girl now? Not requirement. <laughs> I would just like something nice. That's a difference. It, well, okay, if you if you put it like that, then I I agree. <laughs> I agree. That's all I, she's I, saying. I agree. I That's agree. That's all we saying. I agree. <laughs> you will never. If, if you if you put it that way, then I agree. That's all it's I'm like saying. Them. Yeah. You will never. Remember when Barry had a standard. We was like any standard. <laughs> like, a standard. Just a standard. <laughs> yeah. Don't eat Remem the carpet. Like yeah, is that right? just like, have just some shit about you, something. my nigga. Remember we said that, and y'all made and a joke, but it's real. You took my point and ran with it, but that's what I was saying. What I was saying is, I would not. That's date a, funny as shit. Nah, that's hilarious. I would not date a woman that wouldn't do something for me. Just do something. Th and that's but that's something, what I'm saying, my nigga. Literally, I'm not even attracted to the personality of a woman that wouldn't do something for me. And and I did, and, and, and mind you, it's not because I need it or want it. I would it's just. just I, I just like, nice yo, thing. I, 
I would not. For example. I, I, no, wait, no. Let me. I'm talking. Let him go. Okay, well, I apologize. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. He's talking. Listen. <laughs> you dumb? No, because you got me t- you talking dumb? about. No, I because I don't require the shit. It's never. I know. Dumb. You're bugging. No, no, nigga. And, and even with that, shut the fuck up because he's talking. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> you sound stupid. No, I'm we on, on the same side. I'm on your but side. The, the, the I'm on your side. Side. Shut up, let him talk. <laughs> the, nigga. Point, the point I'm trying to make is that I would never, and y'all have seen me date women, I don't require anything have from we? them. Stop it. <laughs> now you really, now you're being me. I don't require anything. I'm not begging you. You know what I'm saying? I'm myself. I'll figure it out. You know, baby, baby. I got it, right? But it's just in their personality. They want to help. They want to be mm-hmm. a part of it. They want to do things for me, too. Yeah. I'm saying I wouldn't date a woman that's not like that. That was what I meant when I said I wouldn't date a woman that wouldn't do something for me. You know? Word. That's valid. That's my point. That's I valid. wouldn't date a woman that doesn't feel like. You know you. Yes. You know who you that go That woman, for, like yeah. the way Sweetie is, yeah. whatever, d- it the made way her she look talks. Untrack- it made her look and it's not about it's not about money. It made her look yes, unattractive. And, 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 if, if, and that's what I'm going to say. But, but wait, wait, wait. Real for quick. me, wait, but, just, I just want to finish and I'm done. Got you. For me, it's not about money. I think she's cute. She is. Right? She's we on our way girl. to the bag, right? So once we got it, ain't like we couldn't date somebody that needs that. But the minute I'm a girl, because I'm like, damn, you can't do nothing? I'm a girl? But I didn't did all of this for you. Can can we talk about the fact that's crazy? Can can we talk about the fact that how pussy is the greatest? Let's do it. Commodity this, is the, on earth? this is the last topic. Let's get into it before we bounce. Let me hit it. Can we, can we talk about the fact that, 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 that vagina is the greatest commodity on earth? So the yeah. So the what topic, was this topic? Let's slide the into topic, this topic later on in that same video. Mm-hmm. She stated did. that because I'm, I'm, she, I'm good. What? What the hell did he hear? You said I'm muted. No, he I said no. Nah, that was him being our ego. Oh, I'm sorry. He said I'm good. I, and I thought you, you said, said muted. I'm, I thought you said yo, you're muted. I'm silent. <laughs> go ahead, Clay. Read this last topic. Mediator, moderator, road oh, coaster. Right, 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 right. We're not doing that. We're not doing that. We're not doing that. Um, and she she went on to say because she has a coochie. <laughs> she th- no, that's what she said. I'm that's what she said. Yeah. She said because she has a coochie, she can a- she can ask for money. Mm. Um, and also she said that because men want coochie and we want uh, uh we want them to cook and 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 take care of the kids, mm-hmm. that should then now allot us to then be a good man and take care of everything else. So what was the question? Why remember? is it that pussy is? A gift to a man for being a good man. Mm. That's the question. Ladies, why is pussy a gift for a good man? I don't know. Did y'all I, see the I, rest? I have the answer. You have I do. And okay. we're not going to like the answer, but it's real. Talk to me. I'm big on accountability. Okay. You shit. Fuck you. <laughs> because I'm big on accountability, I, I can see when men fucked up. We made pussy the most sought after fact. resource on earth. Some of the things niggas have done for we, pussy. Bro, oh we made God. some pussy, some box, some what coochie, whatever you want to call it. We the made most. that the most sought after commodity on earth. And because it's the salt, most sought after it's, thing, it's we we like yo. Pussy so good, I slap my mama. Like, Biggie said he'd suck on your daddy dick. That nigga's. <laughs> Biggie said? said I would suck a man's penis for some pussy. Your pussy is that good. Wow. It's like we made the female genital. <laughs> like the, the pinnacle. The pinnacle of fucking life. Wow. Yep. That's interesting. We, we've made it that high. So now we can't be mad in 2021, when they 2022. Act that way. If they believe in it, walk like, in oh, it. Oh no, you know you have to go above and beyond for this. Mm. So now it's like it's, it's more than slaying dragons. You got to kill your mom. I was gonna talk shit, but that's a really good fucking point, it, bro. We we put it on a pedestal. We made it. We did we, that. We have to blame ourselves as men for that, bro. In every hip hop song, uh-huh. there's there's a man stealing another man's wife. At some point, <laughs> like at some point. Taking your girl. We committing adultery like a motherfucker. Literally, we're talking about pussy. 
Wow. Mm-hmm. Pussy being the highest thing. Highest of the high. It's it, to, okay, cool. So to be honest, it's money and then pussy. It's and one it's A like, and one B. And it's, it's like right, right there. Right. They were right there. Yeah, because once you once you let's say you worth twenty million dollars, the first you, thing you, you think is how much pussy can I get with twenty million dollars? Ex- Hey, That's fucking crazy. exactly. So I can't be wrong. No, no, it's just a mad. concept that I've never heard nobody say. I give bro, you props on that. Bro, it's real. No, real it's shit. Real. I've never, and, and, bro, have you, have you ever heard real. this be expressed? I've never heard that be expressed. It's fucking real. But it's absolutely true. I never thought about it. Yo, wow. we, we over here talking about what? Now, we talking about the fact that we can get some more pussy? <laughs> like, we, yeah, now, no, no. Pussy. And I the will, more money you make, the, the better your stature. The, the more pussy you can more get. Pussy you it's can the more pussy you gonna get. That's a fact. So, real quick, I'm a, I'm a devil's advocate. Well, not even that. I'm going to just give a cross a pen. Yeah. Because I want to fuck with y'all. Is okay. not women that great in general? One more time. Is, is not. So, women aren't that good. They don't deserve that. I'm just speaking for the... Shut up, wait. <laughs> Ooh, but, I'm, but, this, but this is what I'm saying. I'm trying to get real, real quick. I ain't worth... Do that women much. not deserve the pedestal? I have to ask. I'm sorry. We're going to come off as misogynist, and we're going to come off... You took the words out of my mouth. We're going to come off as we're misogynist. We're going to come off wild misogynist. But, but the reason I'm asking this question is because there are three men, mm-hmm. yes. and ladies, if you're watching, I, I literally just want to know how we feel as men. I, I, real shit. Are they worth that? Are women worth the pedestal that we put them on? God damn it. That's tough. Wow. Are they pussy worth the pedestal that we put them wow. on? Wow. Welcome to Willow Wednesdays, baby. Wow. <laughs> Let's get it. women worth the, the pedestal, pedestal that we, we put, put them, them on, on, right? I'm going to raise my hand. Talk to me. I'm going to no, say not women. Actually, no, 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 no. Wait, no, no, no. Women, he raised his hand, bro. I raised my hand. Can I Cause, speak? Cause this is a deep dive. I was going to say women's pussy because it was about but, but this is what I'm saying. Oh, Well, enough. okay. You said women. Okay, I feel you because you're keeping it. Okay. Nah, keeping but. So keeping but women got that. Because they said the gift of being sexual, a good man know. is pussy. But that, I'm trying to I'm, dive just trying deeper. To keep it to I'm trying to keep it directly I'm trying to dive deeper, sir. So what am I answering? I'm trying to dive what a, sep- a second deeper. That's why I said it's going to sound misogynist. Yes. So I, I apologize once again. Misogynistic. Whatever. My bad. I'm sorry. That's not the point. The point is, our. We do a we we the relationship gurus, right? We've been yes. doing this shit for five, six years. Absolutely. Right? Cass and I are married and girlfriends and, and whatever, right? Kids, churn. You, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Mm-hmm. So I'm asking. It came off pussy, right? Because the pussy is the pedestal. What I'm saying is You paying my bills, you get the, some wi- pussy. the women. Is it the women or the pussy that's the pedestal? I know what I said might have been a little crazy, but mm. do they deserve like it's the women. Oh, and this, but this is what I'm asking. Seriously, does that make sense? Does that make sense? What I'm no, it makes sense. I'm okay. not saying I just no. want to make sure it makes sense. So I want to have this conversation uh, real quick. I've, mm. Before you get to, you know, the it's women are. We, I'm curious. Are the women worth? Is it, it worth the pedestal, whether pussy or the one? I'm, is it worth the pedestal? Like, I feel like you know what. What are we doing? <laughs> you saying no? Yeah. You want to know yeah, why? I said no. I said no. That's, that's not worth it. You want to mm. know why? That's crazy. It's not worth it. I apologize for the people that I feel like. like I feel like they're gonna say man ain't worth it either. Cool, <laughs> understood. I'm type just, it, type you it in know, the comments. That's I'm the reason why say, I'm having a conversation. You want to know? And and since you went that deep, I'm gonna say yes. But you, I feel like you, you want to know why I feel like it is a yes. Okay. Because even to this point in my life, yeah, the number one goal as a man has always been, no matter how much success and I get. Is to always get some pussy. <laughs> at the base, at the core of everything. Yeah. Not just as me, like my ultimate goal is just fuck all the pussy, but. Wait, stop making noise in the back. Damn, my, my, you trying my, to creep too. My, shit spilling and dropping. Yo, the number one thing that I'm always going to think of and Go do, ahead, ahead, ahead. I'm going to always for myself be successful. I'm going to try to be successful and make as much money as I possibly can. Sure. But part of the reason why I want to do it at the end of the day is for what? To get some pussy. Okay. So I can't not say, for, and which, which fucks with me a lot, right? Gotcha. Because like I said, this conversation is like, yo, are they really worth the pussy? I, and I've thought about this millions of times over. We put them, we keep giving too much life and power into that. And we kill ourselves just to have sex with them. Mm-hmm. But at the end of the day, That's valid. it's still something that I still want to do. Why? Because I still want the pussy. Well, 
So no matter how much shit I'm, no matter I how much shit I make, talk, and then I'm gonna give y'all like a like a something you know that I. No matter how much shit I make, talk. Guess what? I still want do you, some pussy. Do you have you have any? It's hard. Literally man. worth it. Just worth this. Compared to what we, you know, what do you think, man? It's hard being a nigga, bro. Um. I'm, I'm gonna start by saying I feel like I, I I covered my statement already. You're good, but I'll double back. Um, if if we're being honest, I, I don't I don't think we want someone who's a complete pushover. We don't want anyone who will do whatever we say, when we say it, no. how we say it, we where don't want we that. say. We don't want that. But at the same time. It's an investment, and because because it's an investment, we mm. want someone who's invested. Mm. And and f- for you to sit there and be like, but he's the- I I, I feel th- I, I I feel this way because I want you to do this and you should do this because you're the man. I feel like that's where we fucked up as a people. Mm-hmm. But and even well, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Even I get what you're saying, but in order for you to be in, it could, at the end of the day, to stay to the question, in order for me to be invest, for you to feel like I'm invested in you, okay, that's me still having to 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 give the moon, the stars, and the earth all in one for you to still just as the man of the one, I'm sorry. as the man, okay, for me to still just get some pussy. You know what I'm saying, and no matter how much you may frown upon that, that's what the, that's what this this question and this and that's what the original question and what Dame's question is asking. You're not wrong. You're not wrong. You know what I'm saying. You're not, you're not wrong. I have to you're legitimately. I saw a post on Instagram that the nigga was holding the earth, and Shorty was sitting with her legs crossed, and she said, "That's all you brought me." He was holding the earth on his back, Ooh. like he was at. It's like my nigga, I brought you everything. <laughs> and she Jeez. said, everything. "Is that all you brought me?" Mm. And that's a, and that legitimately that's that's a crazy concept to me. So because I that's do, a tough one, you know what I'm saying? And and I don't want to come off Uh-oh. like it's some Uh-oh. misogynistic <laughs> or any of those things, but it comes off like we have to we have to do so much just to to, to get some pussy. Now here's uh, <laughs> I don't. It we sounds just trying like, to get some pussy. Like, <laughs> you can't trying to get that. pussy, baby. You can't do that, Barry. And no, I know that. because no, if I, I had a daughter, you you have a little one. I would tell her, listen, hey, baby, if that nigga is not willing to do whatever it takes for you, so where's the breakdown, bro? Oh, I, I don't I, know. I, 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 no, I understand, bro, and that's why I, said I was waiting. There's a breakdown. I was waiting, and I said after I get y'all answered, I was just curious. Because I came up with this definition a few years ago through it on Facebook and uh, Instagram, whatever. And and the definition of being a man is doing what you can do. It, I don't know the words verbatim, but it was basically being able to provide for you so that you can provide, wait a minute, for a woman, right? And your family and doing everything. Now, you can disagree with me, right? But... Me trying to break it down. I, I literally wrote it right. Like, I wrote it right, but I, I don't know my exact whatever. This is fucking years ago. I got to find it. And then, you know, hell, next week, whatever, we'll talk about it. But what I realized is what defines you as a man is, in some ways, what we do for a woman. Mm-hmm. Right? I like that. Like, like, it, like it fucked me up. Because I was like, we it talk all this be, shit. It doesn't have to be you necessarily paying all of the bills. It's not that. No, that's fucking I, ridiculous. No, 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 no. You I, got a job a, too, I, motherfucker. I, fuck you doing? <laughs> we both can work. You can put something on something. No, no, no. Right? I'm, I'm following. I'm, but but I'm what I'm saying is it, it, it hit me. And I was like, yo, I, I realized that fuck. We define our lives on how we can provide for our woman and our children. And like I don't on have some real pro- shit. I don't have to provide financial stability for and you. And we ain't just provide. talking money. Right. But I'm just saying, in general, provide don't just mean money. It could be mental stability. It could be anything. Emotional stability. Whatever. I'm here. Right? Protection. That shit fucked me up. So then, that's why I asked y'all the question about pussy on a pedestal. Because I think we just wrong for just chasing pussy. Like, pussy. 
we was chasing women and the yin to the yang. That's a completely different conversation. We wouldn't even be here, bro. But this is what I'm saying. That's why I said, if you're talking about pussy as a man, my whole life has <laughs> has has been, yo, Bari, get the bag, get fly, do all these things you got to do so that at the end of the day, you can always have the option of having whichever pussy you want. Period. But see wow. how you... Okay. No, but okay. at this bare essence, I've, I was that's taught that... That's what they that, taught you? That's what I was taught in terms Sheesh. of, of when, in terms of courting a woman. If you have all of your shit right, you can pick and choose from yeah, whoever, clearly. whatever yeah, yeah. you want yeah. in a situation. Because mm-hmm. I was having a conversation with Drew the other day, and he was like, me and him were talking, you could be ugly, but if you got the bag, you can get 90 to 99% of whatever or, woman or, you or, want. Or what Kevin's saying you said, you got a big ass dick, then you got it too. But if you're if you're a high valued man, you can pull damn near any woman you want, no matter how ugly you are, it's true. because you just have the bag. Jay Z's still ugly. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so he ain't get cute. But what he say? I'm a billionaire. <laughs> I'm cute. <laughs> like, don't matter. So yeah. Well, let's wrap this, y'all. Listen, man. Listen, ladies. Be better than that. You are better than that. You can you can provide way more than pussy to any man I, ever. Bari, I agree with that. Period. It doesn't matter. The mic though. It, 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 Bari, <laughs> I agree with that. Real you know shit. what I'm saying? You 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 I y'all are way that. better than just asking a nigga for some bread. Yeah. And and when he feel and like asking for some pussy, you give him some pussy. No, baby, you could do. God more is God knows more than that for your nigga. Please don't sit there thinking that that's all you can and prov- and will provide for a man because a real nigga is not gonna sit there and just take some pussy from you. I know, <laughs> nigga. Fuck. <laughs> Thanks. Damn, bro. Thank you. Word, but um, yeah. That, anyway, man. I yo, say. I fuck with it, man. Good information. Facts, we facts, facts, this, facts, facts. Um, Once again, please follow the the YouTube page. Subscribe. Bring somebody. Bring them to church. Bring them to the Facebook group. Yeah. Instagram. Yeah. These gentlemen's pages go stream water, go stream. Uh, join the Willow Wednesday family group. Uh, yes. as, uh, you said on Facebook, I know my bad. Like and subscribe, hit the yes. bell on YouTube ding, ding, for notifications ding. every time we drop stuff, man. Mm-hmm. Yo, we see y'all next week, man. Gangster. Bow. Man, I just want to thank you so much for tuning into Willow Wednesdays. We love and appreciate facts, the facts, support. Facts, facts. Yeah, yeah. If you ain't done so already, please hit the like and subscribe button for the YouTube page. Big facts. Yes, yes, yes. And click the bell for notifications. Mm-hmm. And make sure to join that family page, the Willow Wednesday family page on Facebook. Mm-hmm. Peace. Bow.